I'm going to show you how to make a secret phrase on Solana using any coding language. So the easiest way to do this by far is to use the blockchain API. So just a side note, you can use the Solana CLI to do this. Um, but uh, this is basically an easy way to just get it directly. So if you want to learn how to use the Solana CLI, I recommend going to the Solana docs. Okay. Um, what that will do is that'll enable you to create a secret phrase in a wallet basically on your CLI. But if you want to be able to use any coding language and interact flexibly with Solana, I recommend using this, which is what we're going to do. So you go to Solana wallet and you click generate secret phrase. And then here, um, we're going to use Python, but you can use any, uh, any coding language because this is just an API. Okay. So first thing you do is get your API key. So I've already signed in. Uh, it's free to start. Uh, so I just click create new key. I've got these two keys. So let's go. Um, let me just paste them down here. Uh, key ID. Okay. Secret. All right. Now uh, let's check out. Now that we've got the keys down, great. Um, now let's check out the example. So, what makes this even easier is that for uh, for Python we have a Python wrapper. I mean, sorry for um, yeah. So for Python we have a Python wrapper, and so basically uh, you just have to pip install the blockchain API. If you're using a different language, you just have to write the raw API request, which is just uh, a post request. So you know I already have it installed, but you know if you just pip install it, um, and uh, and then let's go to the Python example right here um, and just see what it is. So we just have to set up the resource. So let's do that. So um, the resource is basically just a class that contains all the functions that we need. And it's found in that package that we just installed. So uh, yeah, we just need these. And so we first put in these. These go in the headers if you're using a different coding language. So, um, you know, you see here, um, it's the API key, API key ID and API secret key in the header. Um, and then, yeah, and then there's actually no parameters uh, to set for it. So, um, when you generate a secret phrase, there's nothing uh, special or different from one secret phrase and another in Solana. So, you basically just go generate secret key. And... Um, and yeah, and then and then I'll run that in a second, and it'll look something like this. And uh, yep, so we get this one, and then we get another one. Yep, and so we can keep doing that. We can generate as many as we want. Um, okay, yeah. So one last thing: how do you connect that to a public key? Um, basically. A public key can be derived from three different things, a secret phrase, a derivation path, and a pass phrase. So the secret phrase is the first thing you need. Um, and then if you want to learn about the other two, we have another video for actually getting the public key, which you can watch. I'll put the link in the description. All right. Thanks so much. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments.